Hi there, and welcome to your Brain Boost. It's looking more and more like Amazon's vision of delivery by drone is less and less probable in the near future. But the U.S.'s Federal Aviation Administration has released new rules on drone operation that's going to permit a lot of new ways that drones are going to be used in business, and we're probably going to see more drones as a part of our everyday lives. If you're interested in checking out the rules for yourself, you can find them at a link in the description of the video. Already, we're seeing drones being used for a lot more than photography. For example, the Minnesota Department of Transportation is using them to inspect bridges. Energy companies are using them to inspect wind turbines and cell towers. And insurance companies are starting to send drones that take geotagged aerial photos, which are then combined to create 3D models of things like damaged houses or new homes that might be seeking insurance. In the next two to three years, we're likely to see drones that perform tasks around us. Now that engineers have successfully created drones that are capable of flying and lifting as much as 50 pounds or 23 kilos, we're already starting to see manufacturers that are creating drones capable of carrying canisters that can de-ice roads or runways or spray fields of crops. Other manufacturers have created drones that might soon be cleaning buildings and the windows of skyscrapers. In the next 5 to 10 years, we should expect to see new air traffic control systems being developed, and they're likely going to enable things like Amazon's drone delivery. That's probably when we're going to see the second wave of drones being integrated into society. Are you wary of the world of drones? Excited about it? Let us know what you think in the comments, and we'll see you next week at 10 a.m. Pacific time for another Brain Boost.